time to grow a tree. Hey guys, coming to y'all today with a mukbang, y'all. I cooked some uh, fried dumplings. And I also have some cut up cucumbers on here. Fresh cucumbers. I got a couple pieces of celery on here. And then I also made a... Look, y'all got my salt. <laughs> I also made a stir fry of some cabbage, some purple onions, some white onions, some shrimp. And uh, I put a little sriracha and sweet chili sauce in there. This is sriracha and sweet chili sauce for my dumplings. Um, that's pretty much it, y'all. I'm hungry. It's time to grub. This is my lunch. And... That's about it. I'm going to take this and put it to the side. All right, y'all. Let's give God some glory. We can dive right in. Dear Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus, I thank you for this food. I give you all the glory, Lord. Amen. Y'all, I'm hungry. All right. This is a little cabbage, shrimp, purple onion. Still like that. Let's try that. Got to show y'all a little bit. Mmm. Oh, it's so good. Mmm. Mm, yeah. Mmm. Oh, yeah, that's good. Oh, I also have some fresh jalapeno now. So it's gonna be spicy. Mmm. 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 Dumpling. So what's up, guys? Mmm. <laughs> I'm hungry, y'all. Mm. I'm dipping it in sweet chili sauce and sriracha. Mmm. So good. If y'all don't know, I'm telling y'all, I love onion. I love. So, this is right up my alley. I got some news to tell y'all that I'm so proud of myself about. Mmm. 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 Look at that onion. Mmm. Shrimp. Mmm. But I'm going to eat a little bit, y'all. Mm-hmm. Mm. So good. <laughs> mm. This is vegetable and pork. Mm. 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 I love celery, y'all. I like it with salt. Have y'all ever tried this pink salt? I got it from the Sam's. It's delicious. Mm. Celery. Mmm. <laughs> so good. I have bought like a like a coleslaw blend when I got this. I think I can see that. It was just a mixture bag of coleslaw stuff. Mmm. Okay. Mmm. Mmm. And I was like, I was gonna put it on top of um, like make some tacos with some little flowers. Oh, with some boats. Like lettuce boats. And I was like, this would be good to go on top. Mmm. So like give it a crunch, you know? Mmm. 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 Mm, 
But yeah. So that was off. So I said, let me come with a quick little mukbang. Look, I knew that was going to fall. Mmm, y'all, look at that. That is just delicious. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, I got a little piece of that fresh jalapeno now. Let me show y'all. Mmm, onions. Fresh jalapeno. Put a little shrimp on there. Ah. I lost my purple onion. Mmm. My husband in there with the baby. And they sleep. Mmm. Mmm. That's good. <clears throat> this is my first meal of the day, y'all. I'm hungry. Yeah, so after I eat this, I need to do some things like probably go by my mom's house. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Mm. I really want to thank y'all for all your awesome comments that y'all be leaving. I love y'all so much. Today is just kind of quiet around my house, y'all. Kind of just doing nothing today and enjoying my life. Okay? What are y'all doing today? What are y'all eating today? Leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you're eating. If it's some good stuff, let me know for sure. Okay? Everybody's different. Today, me and my husband was watching, um, I want to say the Food Network, but I'm not too sure. And it was showing different parts of the cow that they use for, like, uh, steaks and stuff. Mmm. Mmm. And they were showing a hundred, wait, a 40 ounce prime rib, 70 ounce prime rib, and 125 ounce, I think, 125 ounce prime rib. That was like this tall. And people was eating that. Y'all, something else. Something to see. Mmm. Y'all, this was so easy to make. Mmm. 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 Ooh. And then that jalapeno wasn't that spicy. Mmm. Mmm. Yeah, so it was talking about the steak. How the um the Angus, the sirloin, and we were looking at how people eat them rare. I only eat like medium well. I don't even like to see no bloody part, but maybe a light pink. You know, my husband like his well done. 
Mm-mm. I can't eat nothing raw. Mm-mm. Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. Mm. I bring back some memory whenever I was younger. And I was talking about this with my husband. This day, I'll tell me if this is true. Like, beef is bad on your heart. <laughs> I don't, I'm not laughing at it. I'm just laughing because what if I'm wrong? But for years, I believe that eating steak was bad on your heart. Like red meat. I mean, and it might be true. Because I think I heard about that before. Excuse me. But I'm not sure. But anyway. So, I heard that it was bad for your heart. Mm. Especially if you eat raw or rare. Mm -hmm. I heard it was bad on your heart. Well, my aunt, she had told me she used to date this guy. Long time ago, she's somewhere. And he was, um, he um, passed away of a heart attack. And she'll say, that's because he used to eat all that, uh, he loved his steak. And he used to love to eat it rare. He put it in the brawler. This is how she talk. He put it in the brawler. And, uh, what you say? Oh, you put it in the brawler just so it gets seared, like in the oven, that bottom part. You say, take it out, and he would eat it, and it would be blood red. <sighs> Celery tough. And so I was like, come real? And she said, that's how he used to eat it. And then he had, had a massive heart attack. Mm -hmm. I think in his 50s. I'm trying to I used to eat a lot of red meat. Mm -hmm. So, if you know anything about that, if red meat is bad for you, and I think they're kind of like, made me not eat steak too much or beef too much, and I love a good ribeye, but it got to be a special occasion or very rare. It's very, not rare meat, very rare that I'll eat it. Because, mm -mm, I ain't doing it. But yeah, they had some stack, some big old prime rib that was this high. I stacked up 1.25 ounces or 125 ounces. I don't know. But that's pretty much it with what I'm doing today. Spending time with my family. And that's it. Eating on some good food. Mm-hmm. I went to the doctor, y'all. And y'all know I was trying to get my A1C down. And I did. Yep. I'm going to tell y'all a little history about that. My A1C was like 9.0 or something when I had first started. I'm telling y'all about it. And it kind of scared me a little bit. So, I'm like, I'm going to eat right. I ate right for a little while. Mm-hmm. Like I usually do. And... Then I stopped, but I started working, y'all. And I'm telling you, working oh, that's a lot of work, okay? It's a lot of movement. So, with me working, I'm exercising more than I ever have, and I push myself, which then cuts down on what I eat. I might eat once or twice a day, okay? When I'm working, all right? Mm, that's so good. But uh, I went and was 9.0. Then when I went back three months before this, it was eight, okay? Now I go to a diabetic clinic, okay? With a uh, when you have diabetes, they take you to a, a diabetic clinic, right? So you can be monitored, okay? So, when I went today, it was down to seven. Y'all, I no longer have to go to the diabetic clinic. I no longer have to uh go and uh 
see this particular diabetic doctor. I am stable in my diabetes. But I still have to take my meds, okay? Okay. Me and him talked today about um I mean me and him talked about um about me um getting weight loss surgery because my appointment is coming up in December. So I was like, okay. And when we talked about it, he was like, you, you know, if that's what I choose to do, I, that was fine by him. The surgeon would contact him and I'll do that for you know, okay. But he said, I'm doing good. That he thinks that I could probably do it because he said people who get weight loss surgery still have to eat right and maintain. He said, but if you could do it without the surgery, you can do it. You know, if you can do it with the surgery, you can do it without it because you gotta still eat right and stuff. Because he knows people who have gained weight back. And it's a lot to think about because I really want to do it. Um, it'll make things a lot easier, but I'm full. With the road I'm on right now, y'all, I think I could probably try and do it again. And with me working and being physical, put a little exercise to it. I mean, I'm still going to eat what I want to eat. I'm going to cut out sweets because I got sugar, Okay. That's the only thing, because I sometimes get a sweet tooth. But other than that, I'm going to just try to incorporate vegetables into my regular meals and cut out rice. That's it. I'm not trying to make drastic changes, because when I do that, drastically, just like, I give up on everything. I, I do it for a good three weeks, you know, and then I'm back. I don't know. Pray for your girl that I can really just, you know, I don't want to call it just like change my life or just eat a little better maybe. Try to drop some pounds and I could be free from diabetes in the next three months, you know? But I really need to make some drastic food changes, y'all. And I know it. So I'm going to incorporate more vegetables and do better. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to try not to eat fast food and I'm going to try not to eat rice. You know what I'm saying? But I'm so happy. It's a goal to get my A1C down to six. Okay. Even five. In the next three months. If I can do this and drop it like ten every, t every three months. It's amazing. I know I can do this. But I still, I'm going to keep my appointment in December. Okay. Because, um. I'm still on the fence about doing the weight loss surgery. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. But y'all, I love y'all so much. Thank y'all for coming to eat with me. Thank y'all for coming to conversate with me. Y'all always remember to dab on your haters, okay? And sparkle on them. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, y'all, okay? Hit that thumbs up button. Um, it helps your girl go up on the algorithm. Um, share, share, share this video. All right, if you're new to my channel, hit that subscribe button if you like these type of videos where I just talk and conversate with y'all. Um, y'all, I'm just being me. I'm chilling. I'm not trying to be fake. I'm not trying to uh, push for the uh, money or the ratings. I'm just going to be me. This is me. Okay, if you're rocking with your girl, hit that like button, okay? And y'all, I will see y'all in the next video. Got more content coming, y'all. Different types of food. Um, mostly it'll probably be cooked food that at home because I'm going to try to incorporate more cooking at home. Um, but that's about it. Um, I love y'all so much. Hope I ain't sucking my teeth too much. No, I'm playing. <laughs> Let me stop. Okay. I'm, I have a habit of doing that, y'all. I don't know. What the crap is going on with that. Anyway, I love y'all. Stay blessed, okay? Bye. Dab on them haters and spark on them and i will see y'all when the next time it's time to grow walk it Bye. like i talk it hey walk it like i talk it walk it walk it like i talk it walk it walk it like i talk it walk it walk